We've decided the best way to explain Thermodec is to actually get out on the job site and, and watch it be put together. So uh, let's just get up on the roof. take a closer look at the Thermodac. I've had the guys remove one sheet of the plywood so we can see how it all goes together. Heat travels three different ways, conduction, convection, and radiation. Thermodac is the only product that stops all three. The first thing we stop is the radiant heat. The aluminum reflects about 97% of your radiant heat. It's reflected right back where it comes from. The second way we stop the heat from getting in the attic is we've got a one inch polystyrene, which is gonna have about a R5 insulation. So it's very difficult for any heat to be conducted through into the attic. And the third point is the convection currents. We use the convection currents to our advantage. The way Thermodec uses convection to its advantage is what puts it all together. What we've created here with the, with the decking on top of the Thermodec uh, is created a one inch airspace. The next step is going to, we're going to be putting a composition roof on top of that. And what's going to actually happen, uh, the sun's going to come out, it's going to heat up the composition roof. Uh, the comp composition roof is in turn going to heat up the decking. The decking is going to heat up the air adjacent to it and it's going to cause that air to rise going up toward the vented ridge. Uh, an additional thing is happening here is the radiant heat's going to go through the composition roof and the decking and normally would accru accumulate in the attic. But in this case, we reflected it back where it's coming from, so it's not going to reach the attic. Another real benefit of the aluminum, uh, it actually heats up from the radiant heat, but it dissipates it instantly. So what, what we have now is a polystyrene, one inch polystyrene, which is gonna give us an R5. So now we're gonna stop the conduction of heat into the, into the attic. Now at the bottom here, you notice we've cut a hole so that we can draw cool air from the soffit. Because as this warm air is rising, something's got to replace it. So we're gonna pull the cool air in from the soffit area, which is, by the way, the coolest area we have. It's, it's gonna be about five, 10 degrees cooler underneath the soffit than it is out, you know, just ambient temperature. So we're drawing the cool air in here. The heated air is actually pulling it on with it and going out, going out the ridge. The key to the Thermodec working is actually making cold air rise. Well, I get the question, how do you make cold air rise? Well, the way you do it is you heat up the air above it, and that's done by just natural, the radiant heat heating up the decking, uh, heating up the composition roofing, and heating up the air in the one inch airspace. It just is gonna naturally rise, and that creates a siphon effect, which draws the cool air in from the soffit, and then expels it through the vented ridge. As you can see, we're about to wrap it up here, and the composition roof just looks like everybody else's roof on up and down the street here. Uh, we know that it's not permanent. Uh, we know it's going to have to be replaced after a few years. But the Thumber Deck is permanent, and so is the savings that go along with it. We had a uh, huge hailstorm come through here as of, yeah, almost about a year, year and a half ago. And uh, when it came through, you know, we knew we were going to have to get a roof redone. We weren't for sure what type of roofing system to go with. Got, you know, friends that have tried plastering the stuff on the inside. They come out looking like the Tin Man. And uh, we did a little research on it and found, found someone that uh, came out and assessed our problem. And, you know, I was real impressed with the company itself. You know, they didn't leave a big mess in the yard, um, which is nice because usually you have that when you get your roof redone. But for the most part, the system itself that he put on our house has decreased our electric bill by over half. We were paying close to $500 a month in electricity. Now, yeah, we've got a pool, you know, we've got a unit that's been on the house since 1978, so I'm sure that doesn't, put, you know, help any. But for the most part, after that was put on, we saw a decrease. It was kind of gradual at first, 
But you know, six months into it, you really started seeing a drop in the amount of electricity you were paying for. And now I think our bill's close to, it's right around 200, 220. So that's a huge reduction in savings. And you know, I would recommend this to anybody due to the fact that it does lower your, your electric bill. The fact is now, you know, our air conditioner did go out since it's been on the house since 78. But we, with the windows open and the ambient temperature that it keeps the, the attic, I mean, it's almost 20 degrees cooler in the attic than it is, than it would normally be with a regular roofing system on there. So we've been very pleased with it. I do, and actually it, it kind of enhances the roof a little bit too because they raised it up. I mean, you're talking about you've got a, a decking of plywood and then you've got the system itself, which is styrofoam with an aluminum backing or something. I can't remember all the terminologies on it. And then it's got the vents that are built in and then another decking of plywood and then your, your, tar, your, your tar paper and your shingles. So it's like adding four, four inches of insulation on top of your roof, where you normally wouldn't have that with a regular system. Certain certain homes have you know everything from the, the aluminum roofing. To, you know, you're talking twenty thousand dollars. I, I couldn't afford that. Um, and with this system here, the fact that you can put the composite roof on top of it uh, makes a huge difference. It looks just like any other home you see on the on our block here other than the fact that we're saving half on our electric bill and they're not. <laughs> I have and uh, actually I think our neighbors across the street are looking into doing it. Um, I've got a couple of friends that you know they couldn't believe the reduction in our electric bill and uh, of course you know you got all these companies out here now trying to give you lower electricity but uh, with that being said, uh, the system itself is you know, it's, it's not only a peace of mind, but it's, it's energy efficient.